Previously on Survive, the tribe swapped from three tribes to two. The new Pierce tribe filled each other in about the happenings of the game so far. And at the new Stark tribe, Katie got to work building bombs and putting a target on Steven, who's the only original Stark member left on the tribe. At the swap, Shannon was sent to exile, where she was able to find an extra vote she missed during Survivor Lakes region. At the challenge, Stark was able to pull out the win, sending Pierce to Tribal Council. Meg found herself in the swing position between voting out Luke or Damon. In the end, she decided to side with her real-world friend Tracy and her alliance of Elena to vote out Damon, keeping Elena's real-world friend Luke in the game. Shannon is now rejoining the game on the Pierce tribe with an extra vote and an idol in her pocket. Fourteen are left. Who will be voted out tonight? <laughs> Shannon coming back is interesting because, so I was talking to Meg and Meg doesn't have the greatest feeling about Shannon. I think Shannon only wanted to work with Joey at the other camp. I tried to reach out to her. She wasn't interested. Um, uh, before we all left the other tribe, Tim was like, we got to drop all the other alliances we had initially starting this game. And she was the only one that didn't pipe up. Guys, there's literally like, we are, we are like back against the ropes. Yeah, yes. Yes. So, I don't know if you guys had any past alliances played out, nope. but Doesn't now anymore, dude. I'm talking. Maybe no, I'm talking about on other teams. Oh, no, I said those don't matter anymore. Like, I mean, we are just like fodder. Yeah, right. We're we're a four. Yeah. We no, it find... is because we need five and six against four. Ah. Uh. Um. So I don't think she's gonna come looking to me to make an alliance with or anything or. She might gravitate more towards Tim, if anybody. Um, but I have no ties to either of them, um, unless she's come back and she's genuinely looking for something. But she's never been genuine in this game so far. I think people don't like Sean, but Lena, to fill you in, uh, Lena is, talks to Luke a decent amount. Sean is doing classic flip flop. Meg seems like she's on board, but still remaining um, in the original four. The original four. Um, I think we don't currently pose a threat to the bunch. I feel like I'm coming in though. Like late. Yeah, like, and you're definitely like some swing in here now. Now that it's three, three, and one. With Luke, but that right? means, I mean, they have Luke, which is worrisome. I think they'll take me out next. Genuinely. Especially after I betrayed them and went with the vote on Luke. Oh, you betrayed them? Well, I did. I went up to them and was like, hey, I'm tossing my vote on Luke. Uh, and they're like, no, don't, don't do that. It's Damon. I go, okay. <laughs> and I did it anyway. Okay. Oops. No, no, no. I, I saw you get hit in the head. So yeah, I was just like, yeah, take it easy. more than I thought. Yeah. I'm gonna go have Obviously the wind feels great, not having to go to tribal feels great. Um, I'm still kind of trying to feel out the team. There hasn't been a whole lot of strategy talk yet. Everyone's staying together in a group. Oh, yeah. Who do you think's gonna go? Damon, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I could see Damon. Because well, who's on that tribe? Luke, Damon, Damon Luke, Sean, Tim, Tim, Elena. 
Elena, Tracy, and Meg. I, I could see them trying to split up Tracy and Meg though. Uh, the tribe swap I think worked out really, really nicely for me. Um, I've got three of my other um, original Webster uh, teammates, uh, Eric, Tim, and um, uh, Becca. And One it wasn't time. even like a real tribal for us. It's insane. It's like, what is, what is going on? Pretty much everyone is, if something does happen, um, voting for Steven, just because it makes sense. Um, and because he's a crazy player. And we do have a strong team, and I don't think losing Steven will affect that strength. I can't believe Sean's still in this game. I thought for sure Honestly, he was going to be first. Honestly, he's been much better this time. Yeah, he, it seems like he actually, he actually like, is trying. He's trying yeah, to actually so. play him. It's up in the air who I would want out first between uh, Steven and Mike if we had to go to tribal, but it doesn't really matter to me. I don't think that I'm going to go. I don't think any of my original teammates are going to go, and hopefully I don't think Katie will go, so it should be between uh, Mike and Steven. Well, it's also terrifying if, like, like, he could do that fucking around, like. Right. If that's him just, like, half-assing it, then. Stark getting your first look at the new Pierce tribe. Damon voted out at the last tribal council, replaced by Shannon. So, first thing, Timothy. Giving Christian trouble, man. <laughs> yeah, I was <laughs> so for today's challenge, we're going back to the first challenge from Survivor Lakes region. There's going to be six of you st staggered into the field. The one last person is going to run out, grab the first person with their puzzle piece, bring them back. Those two people will run out to the third person, grab them with the puzzle piece, bring them back. This is going to continue till all six people are brought back. The final person in the field will have the last two puzzle pieces and the tangram shape that you are solving for. Once all people are back and all puzzle pieces are back, whoever solves the tangram puzzle first wins immunity. Yeah, you guys take a breath. Yes. I like it. I like it now. <laughs> Driver's ready. Go. Here we go. Let's go, Blue. Yeah, hey, you guys got it. There we yeah. Go. Nice. You're beating by a mile. Come and get me. Bring me home. Here we go. Here we go. Mike? Oh, guys! Look at the peak! The peak! Get the peak! Hurry up! Hurry up! You gotta wait for Luke. You gotta wait. Steven, get her. I got her? Yes. Go. Go, guys. You're killing it. Done. Done. Whoa. What the fuck? 
Start! So how do they do that too fast? I mean, it went off. That was funny. Okay, but we're not pretty. And we are. All right, start. Eric, you. You are safe until tomorrow because, Pierce, you have a day with me at Tribal Council, and that's the last thing for today. So, grab your things. Head back to camp. I, I was like, I was like, well, Tim is the biggest and I'm the second biggest, so I can carry Tim. And then everyone was lined up and I was standing in that first spot. And then it dawned on me that I was like, oh, I have to run the entire th <laughs> Bad move. And by like the third, I mean, when Tim was like, help carry Tracy, I was like, I'm, I was in autopilot mode, dude. I was just like fucking moving. My body was like doing all its own. And I was like, literal darkness was coming in from the edge of my eyes. And I was like, this is the verge of blackout. This is the verge of just straight up physical blackout. That's awful. <laughs> Obviously we still have our like majority alliance, me, Luke, Elena, and Tracy. Um, Versus the other three. Then we vote her because if we split it, it's a top. Yeah, but then we have to revote one. Right. So then who do we vote for? Oh, next pick. Mm -hmm. She doesn't. Vote for. If she doesn't vote, you know what I mean? Just be she. We got four. Yeah, I'm just. Right. Three percent. It's more than. But I think everyone at this point is just yeah, overplaying all the time. Yep. Yeah. We're trying to make the. Determination as to whether or not Shannon has an idol from Exile Island and how that will come into play. Camp right now is interesting. Um, basically, it sounds like Tim has lost all hope. Um, but Shannon Casey is adding an interesting flair to the mix. What I think is you and Yes. Yeah. So like Tracy wants to go. Yeah, and I heard you. Is that true? I couldn't trust you. Because before the merge, you were the only one that was going to stop when we said that we were going to cut our alliances. And I'm not convinced that you and Katie are going to power team it up by the time you guys get together. Just to say that other people I felt confident about your bond. I'm not to say that other people wouldn't do it. It's definitely so, a thing. It's either way. The people are worried that you and I don't think you want to that. So, my tight four that Tim's trying to sell me on, Steven's gone. He's never going to fucking vote with us ever again. And fucking Meg has the audacity to straight up, when I confront her about voting for me, she straight up outright says, yeah, I don't trust you. Like a fucking moron. So I'm just kind of like, especially if I've lost you. We well, haven't lost me. Well, you told someone that you were going to vote me out. Mm -hmm. So that was our three. Can confirm. She didn't say that. She did say that she was really with you. But why wouldn't we try to, like, Because you were more convinced that with Joey, when we were trying to make, like, an alliance, you were... Convinced with Joey about what? I don't know, you seemed more, like, every time I would try to talk to you, you were really disengaged. So my trust went down more. Oh, I feel like I tried to talk to you every opportunity. And it's not that you didn't try to talk to me, and we talked a lot. It just didn't feel genuine. Okay, I have pretty... I don't really have in genuine conversations, um, but this is what I'm saying. This is obviously, if I can't trust you guys to be my alliance. Well, we need to find a fourth person. I apparently only have maybe one. Well, we could make it happen. No, because we didn't you just told me that you aren't gonna vote for me to stay didn't say that. I said that. You said you don't trust me. I said, yeah, because you haven't shown that you are trustworthy yet. 
I haven't had an opportunity to have to say that. I voted with you guys every single time the way that you wanted to vote. We only had two opportunities and they were like they were really cut dry. Yeah, but when was I going behind your back saying I'm your not name? saying you were going behind my back. Okay, well. I'm just saying I do think we're all fucked. Right. If we're not together. So even if we don't like each other for right now I'm to not make saying sure I we don't get like you. Yeah. I'm talking about like game wise. Right. I'm just saying but in terms if I can't that, trust my own alliance to vote yeah. my way, I shouldn't I vote with what they're saying. And that's fair. Even if she didn't trust me, I was perfectly trustworthy on their tribe. None of us formed great alliances. We had two tribal councils, had to vote with each other on one. I stuck with her on the other one, so I have no idea why she feels this way about me, but I'm more than happy to fuck her over now. I don't know. All I know is that she literally could, like, piss on me right now. That's how angry she like is. Like, her eyes were giving a dagger. She was like, what, what is wrong with you? Like, do you hate? Like, you said all these things. And I was like, well, She said that to your face? Yep. And I was like, I miss so much. Well, great. So, like, the whole, our initial drive is completely divided. Tim knows that he's going. Yeah. And I am fine with that. And I am also fine with getting to Shannon after that confrontation she just had with me. I just got back to my old teammates and Shannon just got back from exile and within a minute had accused me of like everything that I've ever done wrong to her. But I'm, here's the problem though. So after this, how many people are we down to in the game? 13? Total. Yeah. Okay, so after Six this. and seven, right? So there'd be 13. If we don't win the next challenge. I mean, if we win the next challenge, Shannon goes over to the other side to do whatever the hell she wants with everybody else who's over there, which gives her her Eric, it gives her her Katie alliance. And she was like, I'm not doing that. Everyone else is going to do that. And I was like, okay, so you're super defensive. You're going to do that. And to be fair, I do not trust her at all. Um, and I have said that many times to a few people, um, but she has accused me of uh, going to vote for her immediately, which is not true yet. But anyways, she is just very, very upset with me right now. Okay. I trust you. They don't know you. You know what I mean? All right. I have an immunity that I found on night one. That fucking ass. What? And I'm probably about to use it. Unless you think I should have. I have all of the information, so everyone is coming to me. <laughs> okay. I mean, I don't want you to have to use it. I can. But you should use it. There's a copy out with it, so I can only use it for merch. Use it. Okay. Oh my god. Sorry. I'm like spinning. Um, I'm trying to decide right now if I'm gonna write. Tim's name down and get the trust of Shannon or write Shannon's name down and keep the trust of Tracy. All right, same tribe, but we have one new member. Um, Tim, you and <laughs> Shannon were on the tribe together before. How is it having Shannon back? In um, your life. I don't think it really changed my outcome that much. Really? As far as I know. What is uh, said outcome? Outcome. I uh, my head's definitely under the guillotine. <laughs> Whether or not they're gonna pull the trigger this is a probably. But uh, you know, I enjoyed my time. Elena, do you Pretty think good. that's true? That Tim is on the chopping block per se. Yeah. Does everyone agree that Tim is on the top? I think of anyone from our tribe, the initial Star Tribe, has their head right there. Shannon, you came in and you were on that other tribe, so was it hard? Did you automatically feel like you're under the gun coming in? Um, I wouldn't say under the gun, but I think I was walking into existing alliances that had just formed from the past tribal council. Um, and I also think I was going into it, you know, ready to see what my past alliance was willing to um, 
resurfaced and it was clear to me that they were not willing to stay aligned with me so I need to do what's best for me to stay in the game. Rebuttal. Uh, yeah. Was willing. One of you was. So, is that saying, Meg, you were not willing? It wasn't that I was not willing. I was, I was just not convinced um, that what was said earlier was still true to be. What was said earlier? Not much. I don't think our initial tribe actually had a, a genuine stronghold on anything. Um, I, I don't feel like any alliance that we had going into it um, was going to stay together after a merge or even after a, a, a team swap. Yeah, and I thought that it was, um, and I thought I was, you know, showcasing my ability to be trustworthy. Um, but when the cards were thrown out there that people don't feel they can trust me and the alliance is now broken, I think it makes sense for me to break away from it, which is unfortunate because I was willing to bring that alliance back to the table. Luke, that must feel good for you. You're the last member of the old Webster tribe now in a 3-3. So with all this infighting, how does that put you? Where does that put you? Yeah, I think go coming out of the last tribe, I was definitely pretty nervous that I was going to be the last standing member. And I was like, oh no, it's going to be two, three, three members probably just gunning for me. Um, but like you said, I think there's more going on than just the fact that I'm in the back. And I'm, from the beginning, I mean, from the swap, I'm like, I'm all in on blurring the lines of tribal lines. Like, I don't think tribal lines matter. It's very much with whatever group you're working with. It shouldn't matter who you were with before. It should matter about the new groups you're trying to meet and the new groups you're trying to work with. So I think I benefited from the fact that Daniel went home and i just like to see how this plays out. Sean, you're uncharacteristically quiet over there. Yeah. How do you feel about this whole situation uh, and your original Pierce people? Honestly, I wasn't really paying attention. No comment. <laughs> 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 Love that. He's back. Pulls <laughs> <laughs> the rum. Okay. Tracy, being an original Pierce, how does it feel having theoretically three people that aren't fighting from the same tribe in this tribe of seven? It feels like someone took a monkey wrench and just threw it to hell. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's get spicy up in this yeah. boy. <laughs> Elaine, I see you whispering. You want to share with the class? Yeah. Uh, you do? No. <laughs> I don't want Come on! To to All right. Well, I think... Tim promised some spice last time and it didn't really come to fruition, <laughs> so yeah, this, this, let's see yeah. pop this one's so cool. a little yeah, different. <laughs> Tim, <laughs> you're up first. Initially, my plan was for Tim, but after everything that you've said to me in the past hour, it's got to be you. Tim, I'm voting for you because I have to. Um, if I wasn't going to vote for you, they were going to vote for me. Unfortunately, I really would have liked to work with you if um, Meg hadn't screwed our game so hard. Um, I really would have been down to keep that alliance, so you can thank her. I'll go tally the votes. <laughs> if anybody has a hidden immunity idol and like to play it, now would be the time to do so. Yeah.
This is a hidden immunity idol. All votes for Shannon will not count. With that, once the votes are read, the decision is final. That person will be asked to leave the tribal council area immediately. I'll read the votes. First vote. Shannon does not count. Shannon does not count. Shannon does not count. Shannon does not count. Tim. It's one vote, Tim. The fifth me fifth person voted out of Survivor, Roy Sand Revival. Tim. I think I was going to change this. I will fuck you all around. I had a great time. Tim, the tribe has spoken. It's time for you to go. Yeah, I go wander my way into the woods. Yeah. <laughs> That's back to the there. Well, I know before this, there's been a lot of talk and speculation of if idols exist in this game. I guess tonight confirmed that they do. We have two more days ahead of you, so grab your torches, grab your things, head back to camp. That was tense. That was the most That was the long. That was the long. <laughs> Stay tuned for scenes from our next episode. Um, honestly, I, I pulled the rollover onto my belly method, which, you know, almost worked, honestly. Uh, if she didn't have an idol, it wouldn't have been me. Um, I enjoyed playing, gave it my all, uh, made some maybe regrettable decisions in trying to make a, some spicy plays, but I wasn't about to have a year where I just felt like I was constantly had a target on my head, um, and if I needed to make a power play to get above the pack, then, you know, no one can really blame me. I got two buffs, they on my feet. I'm having a great time. They ain't on my feet, they on my legs. But, uh, you know, firebirds, ah, ah, ready to go. Next time on Survivor, the Pierce tribe has to deal with the fallout from the idol play. And in the morning of day two, will the early birds catch the survivor worm?